coming in when we were in a, such a desperate time in the company. Vince had just gone through the steroid trial. We just had those allegations about the ring boys and all that stuff. The company was probably at a low point. And I, I was that's when I first moved into the office position that I moved into. So, you know, just kind of working through that. And I, I just remember the hard work and the daily work. I mean, you know, the, the hours and hours. And I, everybody, don't you mind working that hard? Or Vince McMahon make you work that hard? No, Vince McMahon didn't make you work that hard. Vince McMahon inspired you to work that hard because he was the one sitting right next to you, you know, elbowing you when you're kind of nodding out to, to keep on going. And uh, the work ethic that the man had, I know it sounds, you know, but man, you know what? I was with him 35 years and, uh, you know, they were a great 35 years, but you know, turning the company around and then watching it grow. Then when it went public, you know, it was a thrill for all of us old time, long term guys that have been there. You know, it's something that you dream of as a kid getting into the business and getting with a company that's going to that's going to grow and just go to the stratosphere, and then being a part of of uh, of, of the growth and and seeing the, the the growth of Stone Cold Steve Austin, seeing the growth of. Uh, John Michaels, seeing Bret Hart catch on win the title, seeing seeing uh, Stone Cold Steve Austin come on, seeing uh, the Undertaker, and you're being a part of all that stuff, you know. And and and, and man, it's cliche as hell, but you're sitting you're sitting there behind those curtains, and you hear that music kit from Monday Night Raw, or you're sitting there on the headphones, and, and a truck is counting in four, three, two, one. All of a sudden, all hell breaks loose with all the pyro and the people and noise. If you don't get goosebumps, something's severely wrong with you. You're not, you don't belong in that position you're in if you're able to hear all that stuff. So, I, just the growth of the company and seeing it grow what, to what it's become and the global enterprise. We always thought it would be big, but nobody except Vince figured it would be as big as it is now. Nobody. Thank you for watching the Hannibal TV. Please like this video if you enjoyed it and click the subscribe button to not miss any of our latest shoot interviews, match videos, or news updates. Follow us on Twitter at The Hannibal TV for instant updates.